Good morning guys, today's the 9th of December, it's Ellie's birthday. One tradition we have in the Swift household is you always get a cup of tea or a cup of coffee in bed on your birthday. So this is where the day starts. Yeah, yeah. I need you to first pick out a mug for mum. Pick out any mug you want. Which one? For mummy. Um, probably not the best one for a cup of tea. What one? <laughs> Okie dokie, that's what you want for mummy. You want this one for mummy? Okay, good boy. Good job. We make it on the floor. You give it to dad, I'll pull it up here quickly. There you go, look. Uh, you want to do, you want to be on tea duty, okay? Tea bag duty is the same. Good job. I'll put it in there. Nice, good job. Remember what we did last night for mummy? Yeah. 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 Look. <gasps> wow. This is all for mummy, isn't it? You helped dad do all this. Yeah, that's the one you got mum. You got mum that one. Dad got mum the middle one, because it says, I love you. And the yeah. last one, the boys got. Well done, boys. Because there's two of you had a little bit extra money, didn't you, to put into it, so you got a bigger balloon. And we also got these. So I've got four. I've got five actually. I got five little five little things for us all to wear for when we enter the birthday room. Ah. Oh hello Saint, I can see you in the corner. Oh. Guys, we got no milk. Damn it. God. I'm a bad husband. I have to go for blue milk. This is Saint's milk, we're normally Green milk kind of people. Can you get mum some biscuits, please? Chocky biscuit for mummy. Sticky. Yeah, Vicky. Can you hold them for mummy? No, you don't want them for yourself. Good boy. Well, should we take the Maryland as well? Come on, let's go. Vicky monster. Good job. Wow, done. Keep it going. <laughs> He's got your biscuit happy and Thank you, with loving kisses on. That's your cup of tea. It's biscuits. Biscuit. Last but not least. Very exciting. Uh, oh, wow. mm. <laughs> yeah. The Queen has woken. Got, got a new technique. The bump and slide. The bump and slide, that's it. The bump and then you slide off. Wait. You say three, two, one, open. Saint, three, two, one, open. Oh. Saint did all this last night. <laughs> Stayed up extra late. Oh. Didn't you, Saint? What? Yeah. 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 We had a few pop balloons, didn't we? These are just little Ow. Uh, few little items that you could use today. You could use today? Or tonight. Ooh. 
I can see things for a cream tea bop. Double cream and strawberry jam. Some scones. Ooh, what? Guess who game? Oh no, I forgot the most important thing. You have to pick one of these to wear. Oh. That's for mum. Thank you. And this is for Boppy. You like glasses, don't you? Uh, yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> what was the one dad I going to wear? Oh, well, wow, that's, that's cool! Um, wow, heck in, Herbie doesn't like to be involved with Herbie doesn't like to be so fine. Yeah! Yeah, heck Wow, Bobby. dad and hecky smile! Mwah! Oh, look. Woof, 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 woof. Roughly translated, happy birthday, mum. Oh. oh. <laughs> to our mum. Thank you. Thank Say thank you, you to them. Thank you, Hecky and Herbie. Thank you for my lovely car. What? Say, did you make that? Yep. And if you look really closely, Mum's also a cake with Good. candles. Yeah! What heck you look, how special. Darling, look at all of your beautiful drawings. Footprint, handprint. And your footprint and your handprint. And a bit of Chalk. chocolate. <laughs> I had to persuade him with chocolate to <laughs> do it. Thank you, dancing. Thank I'm so lucky. To my beautiful Why? wife. Yeah. We're heading to Devon for the weekend. Oh yeah. my god. Yeah. your husband. Wow. That's so why there's our scones. Oh, of course. It all makes sense. We're going on holiday. And I bought us a board game to play. A bath bomb for you to relax oh. in. Oh my gosh, I am so lucky. Yeah. Wow, what a lucky mummy. Thank you. Mwah. I love you. And I've still got presents. Oh my gosh. Mummy is too spoiled. Yeah. Wow, that's a lovely monster truck, darling. official hello and welcome to the vlog from me we have just arrived at my birthday present which is a beautiful little lodge in devon and it is so cute we've literally only just pulled up out of the car so the boys are going crazy and i'm gonna show you around in one sec but honestly i'm ha just having a really lovely day and we've just got here and the sun's Thank about you. to go down Yay. and we spent a lot of the afternoon like packing and getting everything sorted to come here for the weekend. I'm just feeling incredibly grateful and really, really happy. And I'm looking out at this gorgeous field and birds flying past. And I literally just feel like I'm in a movie. <laughs> so look at our view. We're staying on a farm, but we're in like our own secluded little lodge. Like, sorry about her, dog cabin. Saint is just hoovering. Of course, we had to bring the hoover with us hoovering up the leaves good job Woohoo! <laughs> can show everyone around our cabin can't we quick so here it is here's home for the weekend guys it is honestly so lovely in here look at this adorable little christmas tree they've put up here and also this little one here living area with a little bit of decking there to have a morning cup of tea in the December wintry air. Gorgeous cladding on the walls. I love it. This is the kitchen area over here. And then this is bedroom one. 
where we're probably going to pop Saint in his cot. Bedroom two in here. Very snug, very cosy, very warm. Look at the beautiful view outside of the bedroom windows, guys. Then there's a little bathroom in here as well. So lovely. And I'm very excited to be here with my boys for my birthday. Ow! Oh, uh. oh, what? <laughs> Hello, guys. Sorry, it's been a bit of a fun manic birthday day today I need to really sit down and catch up with you all but we've just Ow. popped out for a bit of dinner haven't we Ow. oh what saint seems to be finding something quite sad at the moment Ow. oh what hello Son? Why? <laughs> oh quick we better run away from dad then just found somewhere to come for dinner we're at a little pub near the airbnb which by the way i am obsessed with connor has absolutely nailed it it's like the coziest little christmasy wintry getaway and look at this gorgeous pub that we found for dinner this was on the recommendation list of the airbnb and they've got their christmas lights up i can see inside it's dog friendly so we can bring the boys happy days and we're ready for a fun weekend aren't we baby and they do saints favorite food here fish pie for dinner he's just having a, one of dad's chips a little star because his sausage and mash is a little bit hot i got the adult version I'm very excited for your sausages aren't you it is so cute in here. There's a little fire, Christmas lights. Was that for the Christmas tree? We've got the dessert specials over there with uh, apple and mixed berry crumble with potted cream, which is calling my name. But it's, yeah, so lovely in here. Not much better. I'm happy with this stuff. On a cold December night. For your birthday. today saying you look very handsome good morning everybody from an officially 27 year old Eleanor Swift today it is our first official proper day here having a little bit of a slow start god how long is it taking me to do this earring to our morning today because we woke up this morning and the pipes were frozen. At least I think they were frozen. Saying the pipes were frozen. Just what I'm saying. The pipes were frozen. I don't really know if that was the actual reason. But we didn't have any water. So, luckily, the people whose Airbnb this is are literally the loveliest people in the world and they're really, really helpful. And Wind oh. came to sort it out this morning. So, we did think we were going to have to move into their cottage. Basically, this is based on like a big farm i literally feel like i'm on yellowstone ranch guys if any of you watch yellowstone there's so many little like cottages and lodges and then they've got the, the main like farmhouse where they live um and she said oh don't worry it's fine we've got a cottage that you can stay at i can make sure it's all ready for you so they, they're really really lovely people but luckily we're working and i would have been sad if we would have had to leave the lodge because this is so lovely here but anyway we are heading out for a little bit of breakfast now the handbook here is really really insightful and so last night before we went out for dinner i spent a little while going through like some of the restaurants and stuff that they recommended and there are some really gorgeous places so we're going to a place called i think it's called Sid sidmansbury kitchen in a place called bridport and it looks really lovely so i'm excited it is absolutely freezing cold today look at the view outside of the bedroom it really feels like such a frosty beautiful cold december morning 
and it's making me feel very festive. Little gorgeous babe. Oh. Oh, what? Oh. 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 Oh, is mummy interrupting your TV programme? Look at these gorgeous curls, guys. Oh. I just cannot bring myself oh. to take him to get his hair cut. I really, really can't. Any other mums like that? Like, how far are we going to let it go, really? But I just can't take him to the haircut place. Bye to our little lodge for the morning. See you again a bit later. Absolutely just stunning. Horses aren't quite out yet this morning. They're still napping. They're still asleep, box. Oh. Where's this cottage we could be in, honey? Isn't it? I don't know. It must be this one here. I think it cottage. is. That's what she said, yeah. Oh, oh now Dad wants to Bobby, say in the cottage, we, Saint. You should we can freeze the pipes tomorrow, tonight so we get to go in there later? <laughs> Look, it's so beautiful Bye. here. Bye. Are you saying bye to the lodge? I actually just had a text from the lady. She said, hi, I do hope the water is running okay now. I'm so sorry, my husband thinks the sheep must have knocked the lagging <gasps> off the pipe. Oh, was that Herbie in the night? Cheeky sheep. If you'd rather, you're welcome to move into the cottage. Oh, don't give us that option, innit, Bubby? <laughs> yeah. But Bubby, I love our lodge. You don't love our lodge? I do like our lodge, too. Look, this is another little we need to go into adorable. Oh, I just love it. I just look. All of this is still the farm, guys. All of this. Oh, look, and we're following the tractor up. Oh, oh. look, saying we can see in a sheep. Mile, turn right onto. I just love the countryside. Don't you, Con? Yeah. yeah. But then when I'm in the city. I... No, I think I've, I'm a countryside kind no, of guy. I'm a countryside I think girl, I'm like honestly. seventy percent countryside, thirty percent city. If I had to break yeah. it down. Hey, look, yeah. look, was it one of you cheeky sheep that knocked our <laughs> I pipe? Think it was. Which Herbie? one do you think it was, saying? Herbie jumped out. Are you blending with her? <laughs> <laughs> no, honestly, I do think I'm such a countryside girl. I think basically. <laughs> get me a farm for my thirtieth con. <laughs> <laughs> you know my. Moon. Hang on a minute. Uh, does anyone know about your new um, retrograde phenomenon? Come and on. how much you love it. It's a retrograde phenomenon. Your Saturn return. Turn right. That one is Saturn return? It's a Saturn return. I'm not in my Saturn return yet. I've still got a little while before. Guess I... who's got their Saturn return coming up? Yeah, you do. So my rising sign is Cancer and my moon is Cancer. My sun sign is Sagittarius. So basically, it's the can and Saint is Cancer, you know that, don't you? Yeah, that's the sun sign. Uh, Basically, it's like a real Cancer trait to be a home bird and to really love your home. Mm. But then the Sagittarius in me loves the exploration. <laughs> and I think the Gemini in you brings that out. But also, Tell you what, I'm actually, such a home bird. When as I well. went to buy your oh, I love the country. balloons for your birthday, mm. there was actually a booklet. Of star signs and one of them was Gemini, so I picked it up, had little reads, yeah. and I'm pretty sure it said Gemini makes me a home guy as well. Well do you know what Con? I don't know all that much about it. I just go off <clears> of what other people tell me, but I really want to I think explore it more. You are your own person and you make your own destiny, regardless of what time the sun comes up. Literally got the cutest picture of Herbie and Hector on my feet doing pictures today, Con. And this one, look at this one, guys. Look, that's Puppy Hack. Oh, oh. Puppy Hack, always one of a kind. So cute. We have arrived at the location. We've got baby piglets that Herbie and Hector want to see. Mum and Sina colour coordinated, of course, as always. And you are. I mean, I do try. <gasps> wow. Oh. oh look. Oh. Hi, <gasps> Piggy. Kiss your baby one. That's it. Hello. Here comes Ellie and her date. Still mastering downhills, aren't you, Bob? 
Uh oh, there's a home and garden shop. That's where you'll find me later. Ah, doggy. Harvey's getting jealous. Three. Oh, how cute. remember in our decorating for Christmas video dad yeah it's a big mistake. broke Saint's bauble of the year left me feeling devastated it's a tradition we're doing with him he had a bauble last year and this year he actually like picked I think we put it in a vlog he literally like picked out the bauble that he wanted and it was a little truck is that the blue bigger than this and it was blue and we've just seen them in this shop in Sidmansbury Estate and Connor was like oh that could be his bauble but I want the same to pick it so oh. right tractor which one which one which one uh, uh, that's the, the red one tractor. That we last saw you at breakfast and now we're joining you at lunchtime. We're now a food eating channel. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we could do that, couldn't we? We could do that. We could do that. Every time we go somewhere new, we're like, right, we ask you guys where are the best restaurants. Anyway, actually one of them was this place here called The Rise in West Bay Beach, which we've just parked up at and we're having a little stroll. And we've been, look how gorgeous it actually is. It's on like its own little, island thing anyway just went in there to see if they had any availability for lunch and they only have tables outside and it's absolutely freezing we've booked a table there for dinner instead and there are loads of really really sweet little fish and chips huts like this that i think we're gonna order some chips from to keep us going have a little run around on the beach for the boys and just explore this little town it's a really gorgeous little seaside fisherman's town Oh, I don't know. These look good. Cotton, to be fair. Should we get some here? Oh, what to get? Cheesy chips, chip... Oh, I've not had a chip butty. <laughs> oh my God, in a long time. I'll have a chip butty now. Chip butty? Did you ever used to have them regularly? Yeah, all the time. I can imagine you did. You liked all stuff like that, didn't you? Do you know what, what was? What, chips tell everybody. Bread. No, tell everybody what the waffle thing you used to have was oh, all the time after heard school. This story before, I don't know if they have. Basically, potato waffles, <sighs> cheese, and mayo, loaded really on top of each other. I don't know why. So I can imagine a chip butty would have been up your street. Yeah. Should we get them? Oh, look at the Christmas lights. So yeah, West Bay ones. I've not got one of those in the world. <laughs> Do you know what? I'll get a chip butty as well, Con. You want chip butty as well? Yeah, food please. Butty, please. Spotted this Harbour Amusements little stop from the food. The food huts are over there. There's a big tractor with Saint's name on it with Bob the Builder on top. Do you want to go on the tractor? Uh. Do you want to go on? Uh. Yeah? Honestly, days like today like, truly are like my happiest moments. You know, especially as a mum, like yeah. moments like this with Saint. Wee wee wee. wee. Mummy will put some money in a minute and it can get going. Be. Bob the builder. Beep beep. Beep beep. Good boy. Beep beep. beep. On Bob's helmet. Beep beep. beep, beep. Um. Yeah, just like family days out at the beach, the sun shining, it's like two weeks till Christmas, my birthday. I feel really happy and I think it's moments like this in life where you really have to just sit and relish in the happiness because happiness is something that we often all chase. So just standing in this moment and being grateful for it and just feeling the happiness is what life's all about. Sounds silly from a little Bob the Builder tractor outside in amusements. 
like hut <laughs> waiting for my chip butty but yeah beep beep gorgeous view beautiful sun happy life here comes dada with our food <laughs> Mum, turn it on for you. No, you need change. Oh. I know. Oh, he on. keeps pressing the button. <laughs> He's like, go. Ah. You want to come sit on Dad? And I'll get the... We just yeah. met the nicest group of people. Yeah. Um, they helped us out big time. Yeah. Um, Look at the, like, it's not even, it's like a sp mixture between sand and pebbles. And they were all in like this massive bottomless brunch and they all wanted a big group picture so we all walked up the beach together and they helped us with the pram and it was just really lovely wasn't it it was a nice moment friendly we love a friendly gang here's my chip butty guys the boys are ecstatic to be on the beach look at her bee just scouting out they're both waiting for the ball to be thrown saint's got his chicken nuggets and chips is it yummy babe mm. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And this is actually, guys, where Broadchurch was filmed. If any of you guys watched that. Yeah, because look, that was on the pier. Yeah, we were trying to remember, weren't we? What happened at the end of Broadchurch? I've literally watched it twice uh, and can't remember. Oh no, we've got sand all over our hand. Oh wow, that's it, buddy. Mm. You look good. Mm. And also, look at our pram. <laughs> it's left up there because it's such a steep hill. We're keeping an eye on it. Look at this. Time for a time lapse. being their mums, watching them in this much pain and sadness about football. So, yeah, that's what we've been doing tonight, really. I've also just been doing a little bit of online shopping for my Christmas, um, like, a table stuff. I haven't bought anything because it's, like, 9 o'clock on Saturday night and I'm just still not, like, 100% certain on what I want. I mean, and then I just tell myself there's no point in me ordering tonight anyway and getting myself all flustered about it because it's not going to be dispatched till Monday anyway so I may as well wait till Monday to make the order. Do you know what I mean, Con? But then it's rushed because then it only has like X amount of days to ship and get to my house. Yes, you know? Nice. Anyway, that's us tonight. We've literally just been chilling here. I am about to go to bed and I love you all and I'll see you in the morning.